Hi, Mark from Whole Latte Love. Very excited to have Reiner Stanella here from uh, BWT Water and More. Uh, we've been looking around for a long time. Reiner, you're coming to our rescue with one of the best uh, water purification systems for specialty coffee that we've come across. Um, happy to have you here. I do appreciate so much being here. Thank you for the invite. Now, my, my pleasure today. Thank you. Now, BWT, they, they're like the number one in water purification for the food service industry in Europe. Correct. BWT is actually amongst the biggest companies in the world. It's a global company. Um, with the Water and More line, we are the biggest company in Europe providing water for the food service industry. That's true to say. And you've worked in pharmaceutical applications and, and other stuff as well. Absolutely. BWT can be found in pharmaceutical applications, fuel cell developments. We are very strong in the consumer industry. Um, you find us in uh, households with uh, table water filters. BWT is a 100% water focused company. Okay, so the system it's a, the, that we have is, is, well one of them is the, uh, the cartridge system. So it's, right. but it's all based on this right here. So why don't you tell us what, what we have here. Which is actually true to say if you look into our water filtration products in the water and food service industry, um, it's single-use cartridges and all is based on a filtration head mm -hmm. where I have to say that the uh, filter head fits any cartridge that goes out into the industry. There's a lot of different products which we're not focusing on today. Right. Um, going into ice applications, going into wear washing, going into uh, steam and bakery equipment. We're looking into uh, specialty beverages and espresso, um, but this filter head fits all the cartridges based on your applications. Um, what makes this filter head so unique, there's a couple of features on this head. First of all, if you have it installed in your cartridge and you take it out of the cartridge, it has an automatic stop valve. So as soon as you take the cartridge out of the filter head, it stops so there's no spilling and no, no splashing on the floor. So really easy to change out. Oh, absolutely. As you can see, I mean, even I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> so it only takes a couple seconds and everybody can do that. The unique thing is once this filter head is installed, um, you can actually flip the cartridge towards you so okay. there's no space needed below it or if it's under a sink you can actually easily access the cartridge. Second thing is that every filter head has an intake and an outtake check valve. Mm -hmm. That prevents from water if you have a pressure drop in your main line going from the filter back into your main line. Mm -hmm. And then second if you have a pressure drop at your equipment, no water from the equipment can contaminate the cartridge. The unique thing which is very uh, which is a very uh, nice feature for the entire espresso and coffee industry um, is a blend setting. How do you justify that your water quality from Seattle into Los Angeles, from Los Angeles into New York and Miami is the same? Based on Because you've got different filtering requirements based on the water that's going through the filter. Absolutely. Absolutely true to say. I mean, what do you want? You want, you, you have a nice piece of equipment, you spend a lot of money on your equipment. So what do you want? You want to get a nice beverage, you want to get a nice flavor, you want to get a nice appearance for your beverage. Mm -hmm. But you also want to protect your equipment. Right. So based on the intake hardness, you have lime scale buildup in your equipment, which we prevent with this system, not only with the filter head, of course. What you do is actually, based on your intake hardness, you set a certain blending. Mm -hmm. That means 100% of the intake water will always be filtered, okay. but only a certain part of the water will go to a so-called ion exchange process. We use a weak acid resin where the weak acid resin actually captures calcium ions that are attached to hydrogen carbonate preventing from lime scale buildup. That's the only cause of lime scale buildup. Right. Now what makes this cartridge that you have chosen uh, <laughs> so unique, that's kind of like an upscale cartridge because not only it prevents from lime scale buildup, but yeah. it also releases magnesium. Okay. Where magnesium is the flavor boost for the water, but it's not a cause of lime scale buildup. So on one hand, we're taking down, we're reducing the risk of lime scale buildup by addressing calcium, mm -hmm. but we're also releasing magnesium, which gives you an additional flavor boost for your beverage. Because you don't want absolutely perfectly pure water to make espresso absolutely, or coffee. Absolutely, absolutely no. It's not no. going to taste good. No, I, <laughs> I appreciate you bringing this up. Yeah. Uh, coffee lives with minerals. So yes. on, in order to get a nice flavor, in order to get a nice appearance of your beverage, beverage, you need minerals in your water. You could easily take everything out, but that's mm -hmm. not what we want. The roasters, the roasting industry, they're always looking into certain grains per gallon, which is somewhere between three and five. Okay, okay. And now this cartridge here, so this is this one, what, the, which one is this now? 
That's the best Max S. That's the smallest size, which we decided with your team um, that would go into either a small commercial application, but also focusing on the consumer in on the residential industry. Uh, if you have a nice piece of equipment, first of all, giving you the flavor in the beverage, appearance of the beverage, and protecting your equipment. Now, what and what folks might like about this is if used properly and set up right. No descaling of your equipment no, is necessary. No, I mean, this is why you install it. I mean, this really prevents you from lime scale buildup at your equipment. Because that magnesium you put back in for flavor does not that cause scale buildup. Magnesium is not the cause of lime scale buildup. Right, okay. Right. Exactly. Okay, but then we ha we have other other types of cartridges that we sell to take care of specific problems. Absolutely. Um, um, this is actually what what I would call the ninety eight percent solution that will work <laughs> everywhere. Okay. But of course, let's say you are in a very low hardness area. Right. Um, in certain parts of the country, you would not need to address lime scale buildup. Right. But you still have chlorine. You still have chloramine. You have off taste, and you have particles and dirt in the water. Right. So you would just use a best taste cartridge, which is actually an active carbon with filtration. Okay. So you're filtering out particulate matter and yes. uh, all the chlorines and chloramines and and that type of thing Absolutely that people don't correct. want. And just now, just so we're clear, you can set up a bypass based on on the input water hardness, so you're not using extra filter no. capacity or and going, you, it'll last longer that way, right? Absolutely true to, to say. Set it up, right? um, if, if you are in a rather low hardness water, why wasting capacity of your filter right. if you can blend it? First of all, you actually always uh, get the same quality of water, but you also get a higher capacity out of your filter. Right. Where if you are in a very hot water area, well, your blending setting is different because you need to address more of the calcium in the water. But even when you're bypassing, 100% of the water through is, is yes. doing the, the chlorine, correct. the carbon filtration, which takes out the chlorine yes. and any particulates. Yes. There's actually two stages of filtration. There's an intake and an outtake filtration, and all the blending water gets filtered as well with active carbon and filtration. So with this one, no worries. Put it in, no descaling. Uh, you know, you're going to get the recommended amount of minerals Absolutely. in there for flavor. Um, so now also along with the, with the cartridges, we've also got some accessories. There's there are certain features and benefits that you can add on depending on how you set it up. First of all, there is a flush valve. Any filter, and, it's, and the, the nice thing about this filter, there's nothing that needs to be activated in the filter. Okay. But the filter has trapped air. And in, in order to get a constant flow, you yeah. can either do that through your equipment, uh -huh. which takes longer, or you just add on a flush valve. By pushing it, you release the, the uh, air, the trapped air, out of your filter. OK, OK. So. Uh, no, no risk of, of putting the air into plumbed right. equipment and that kind of thing with exactly. that. And then we've got some, some meters that will tell you when you need to change. That is, that, uh, I appreciate you bringing <laughs> yeah. this up. I almost forgot about it. Um, yeah, I mean, this is, an, this is a flow meter that goes actually in line uh -huh. with the filter. And the same thing, you just install it to the filter head. This has been used so many times. I just show it to you. <laughs> yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> But we've got, um, we've got all the, all the uh, accessory components to, to get a complete system absolutely. going. What happens with this flow meter is, and I appreciate you bringing it up, um, you actually set it to your intake water hardness and to the size of your cottage. It tells you the capacity and it starts counting down. So it actually tells it you when yes, the water that's going meters. through. It actually tells you when to replace the cartridge. So no, no guessing is, is my water still I'm good. Not, I'm not much in favor. I mean, it's still common in the industry to replace a filter based on, on a time span time scale, every right. four months, every six months, every 12 months. Right. What is it going to tell you? You can either have remaining capacity on your filter, right. and you're wasting money, right. or your filter is already exhausted. Then you're going to the risk of what we talked about all day. Right. Lime scale buildup, bad flavor of your beverage, no, no nice right. appearance. So that one tells you when to replace the filter. Great. And now, so uh, typically you'd use this in a plumbed-in machine, but also we've, we're going to have the stuff so that you can just get, you know, like an extra tap at the sink and... Absolutely. And, and do that. Okay. Yes. Um, well, Ryan, listen, I thank you very much. We're very excited to have this available for our customers now um, who really want the finest water going in their machines. They want the best tasting coffee and they want to protect their investment and maybe do away with descaling on Absolutely. a regular basis. And I really do appreciate the opportunity you're having me here today. Thank yep. you so much for that. So, so look for the BWT products at wholelattelove.com. Uh, it's a way to keep your machines in great order and have better tasting specialty coffee at the same time. Hey, why not subscribe now for easy free access to more videos on everything coffee brought to you by wholelattelove.com. Oh.